Will I make friends while teaching English abroad? For anyone contemplating leaving home to live and work in an unfamiliar country, there are several common concerns. Not least, will I make friends during my stay? While it is possible that you will initially feel a little homesick, the vast majority of people who head off to teach English abroad soon develop a network of friends and colleagues from both their host country and elsewhere in the world. Of the tens of thousands of people who head overseas every year to teach English abroad, the vast majority will have some level of anxiety about meeting new people and making new friends. The good news is that most teachers soon forget these concerns once they are immersed in their new environment. The chances are high that you will not be the only foreign teacher in your new school, apartment building or neighborhood. As well as other teachers, you can also expect to meet friendly and welcoming people from the local community who will be more than happy to help you settle into your new home. Work colleagues. One obvious source of friendship in your new life overseas will be your place of work. The majority of teachers will find there are other foreign teachers working in the same school, many of whom are in exactly the same position. More experienced teachers will also be an invaluable source of knowledge when it comes to settling into your new surroundings, both within the school and within the wider community. Although your fellow expat teachers will certainly be a valuable resource on arrival and an obvious source of friendship in the longer term, don't overlook the opportunity of getting to know local people. Within the school, there are likely to be many local staff members who are keen to share both their culture and their community with you. Online A quick online search is likely to bring up a variety of expat groups, forums and blogs related to the city or country where you are living and working. Through these, you can explore all the manner of activities that bring like-minded people together in your area. From hiking and biking, to book clubs and wine tasting, you are sure to find something of interest that will also allow you to meet a wide variety of expats and locals. Sports Watching and participating in sports is one of the most popular ways to meet new people and settle into a new community. Wherever you are in the world, there will almost certainly be local sports teams or fan groups that you can join. Football, soccer is huge throughout much of the world, particularly South America and Europe, while baseball is equally popular in many Asian countries such as Japan and South Korea. Many countries also have a traditional sport that can offer a fascinating insight into the culture and way of life of local people. Expat Hangouts Wherever there are expat communities, you will also find a variety of expat hangouts. Most major cities can boast at least one popular bar where expats conjugate to eat and drink and watch major events such as the Super Bowl or the FIFA World Cup. Bookshops, coffee shops and international restaurants can also be great places to make friends, so ask your colleagues about popular venues in your area. Language Lessons Many people teaching English overseas will consider it important to learn the local language, and this can also be a good way of making friends and contacts. In-class language courses in your local area may well attract numerous foreigners in a similar position to yourself, while helping locals with their conversational English can also lead to friendships and a greater immersion into the local community. The above are just a few of the more common ways to meet new people and make friends amongst locals and other expats during your time overseas. Wherever you find yourself in the world, don't be shy about approaching colleagues, neighbors and other community members as you never know what fascinating adventures it might lead to.